Filling out my cup, coffee talk on the screen porch So in love, now you're the one I'm losing sleep for And I hope the wrong ones slip right through your magic fingers And I hope we find some way to fall in love like we were Yeah, you're the only reason I was California dreaming in the first place Seeing you in sundress seasons got me all up in my feelings for the old days Old days Good day, good day there friends. I hope you're having a fantastic day. A day as good as mine. And today, I'm on a little uh, exploration out here in, um, in uh, Devonport. I found a winery. <laughs> I just wonder if they use grapes or not. <laughs> Actually, um, a few um, about a month ago, um, I have um, had a uh, solar uh, panel installed, and um, the um, uh, the individual who's in charge of my contract actually gave me a bottle of uh, strawberry wine. So, um, oh no, make that uh, hibiscus wine. I have not tried it yet. I intend to. <laughs> so, I'm going to go ahead inside and see exactly. What is eating Gilbert grapes? Or what are these wines made of? <laughs> Thanks for coming along with me. So my friends, I'm on a risky adventure. I'm at the True Blue Winery. <laughs> if you remember uh, in my introduction, I asked, what kind of grapes? Where is it grown? Well, I got the answer. And uh, let me show you their presentation. See if we can pan that down a little bit there. So, <laughs> um, so we're looking at this, um, uh, the, uh, the reds. And uh, this rosé uh, is said to be uh, grown here um, at the uh, winery in uh, Devonport. Uh, between the, uh, the white and the rosé in this row here, um, that is grown in the um, in La Louisiana. So, in this little sippy cup, I'm gonna pour. Um, Let's start with the uh, rosé that is grown here at the uh, True Blue Winery in Devonport and see what the result's gonna be. So, all right, and by the way, <laughs> I ordered cheese and crackers. <laughs> this is far from Las Vegas <laughs> or anywhere I've ever been, but you know, 
<laughs> when you're out there in the country <laughs> of nowhere. Um, this is just an experiment. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so, my friends, <laughs> before I start, <laughs> you get the first bite. I'm telling you, you know, laughter come from many different things. And uh, life is as hard as you make it or as easy as you make it. <laughs> this makes my day full of laughter. A little bit of cheddar. Before I take the first sip, you get the first sip. When something is surprising and shocking, it can be good or bad. My mother used to say, Lord of mercy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm drinking it because it's an experiment. But if you ask me, it tastes like blueberry juice. So that was actually the blackberry. <laughs> Sorry, I can't stop laughing. And now I'm heading into the um, semi-sweet, also grown here at the True Blue. <laughs> at least I give you a glass. <laughs> a part of my deal. Ten dollars for a whole nine sip. <laughs> oh, let's see what this tastes like. The first one was the um, tastes like. Uh, did I say uh, blueberry juice? Let's take a look at this one. Oh. Oh no. Uh, this one tasted like um, uh, fermented cabbage. Oh, can't do it. Okay. All right, let's head into the... Uh, that was semi-dry, by the way. I'm heading into now the semi-sweet. Let me angle this so you can see what I'm talking about here. Okay. So now I'm heading into the Simon Sweet. Okay, so the second one was a, uh, as I mentioned, fermented cabbage. Taste this one here. Oh, mamma mia. My mother would say, Lord of mercy. Okay, this one here is the um, cousin cabbage. <laughs> Can't drink it. It's an experiment, remember? Okay, back to the sweet. Also grown here at the uh, True Blue. I have to find out exactly where the grapes are because I've not seen any around. I've seen bamboo trees. Um, I've seen um, everything else except grapes, so let's see. And by the way, this thing have a have a kind of um, film on top. I don't know what the heck that is. It's like uh, um, some kind of uh, oily film. But here we are. I'm now in the uh, in the uh, sweet grown here at um, 
at uh, True Blue. A little better. More like raspberry juice. Can't finish it. Gotta pour it out. Okay, now on to Louisiana. Let's see if we get a better result. Okay. So Louisiana, we have the uh, orange, we have the peach. Bring that down. Orange, peach, cranberry. <laughs> Wild. Musca uh, muscadine and the uh, the red um, muscadine. Okay, so here we are. So let me give the um, orange a try. Orange is white. My, my. I think a wine cooler has a little bit more um, oomph to it. So I'm not going to finish this. I'm going to pour it out. I'm off to the peach. Orange, peach. Let's see, this is peaching. Honestly, I almost want to say the taste is indistinguishable. Give it one more shot. A little bit of lychee. Just a hint. But as small as this sip is, I can't finish it. Now I'm off to the cranberry. Cheers. <laughs> My friends, I think they're fooling me. This is cranberry juice. But for all the one I've tasted so far, I have two to go. This is the better taste. Still can't finish it. Like I've always said in all my videos, you don't try it, you don't know it. Okay. I'm down to my seven, seven sips. This one is the uh, wall. Um, let's go dive. Okay, a little bit of frappe, and it would have been tasty. <laughs> oh, what an experiment. 
<laughs> oh, I'm telling you, you don't try it, you don't know it. Still can't finish it. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I gotta clean my, cleanse my palate, a little bit of cheese, cheddar and crackers. That's some panel. Mm -mm -mm. This one is definitely cough syrup. Oh. So my friends, you can ask me, what's my experience here at the True Blue Winery? It's really blue. <laughs> I don't know about the true part. <laughs> but like I said, it's a vlog putting something on the board. It's more experimental than anything else. I don't know if I'll be get caught. I don't know if I'll get caught here at night. I will be get if I'll get myself. <laughs> if I'll be caught here at night, let's put it this way. This, I think the I think the uh, the flavor the the flavor of this wine <laughs> is causing <laughs> is causing. <laughs> brain malfunction. short video. The best part about his experience is not even the cheese. It's just about coming out here after uh, looking at the sign of uh, 27 about the winery experience. I thought I'd give it a shot. Regrets? No. Learning a lesson? Yes. <laughs> you don't try it, you don't know it. So. The next time you pass that sign out there. All 27 within that you're heading um, north or south. Take it from me. You can wait. True Blue Winery. Easy as pie. apple or cherry. Loving you is so very sweet. Sweet, how can it be such a piece of cake? And your smile is the icing. 
Loving you is a part It's sweet, sweet, sweet How can it be? And you make my candy coated heart melt When you take my hand And I am under your spell Baby, I crave your affection When I stepped in sweet confection You're my sugar I'm pleased as punch Whether spiked or sparkly You make me tipsy and bubbly If you're a dessert I want the last cards first Oh, how I love Okay, my friends, so here we are. Just finished uh, wrapping up inside at the uh, True Blue uh, Winery. And uh, heading back to my location. Like I said, I still yet to find the grapes here. <laughs> But I guess I gotta take their word for it. <laughs> oh my, my. <laughs> So my friends, until then, this is you Jamaican in the mood saying one love. <laughs> If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Very important. Your comment is also important. <laughs> until then, peace. Love you, my friends. <laughs>